Friends, denizens of the internet, hello and welcome back to another exciting episode of Death Stranding Director's Cut over here, Lost Time Gaming. I am Devo. We are jumping back into the shoes of Sam Porter Bridges when we left left off. We were running from some sort of giant tentacle lion, which is what I'm calling it. Ah, oh, really? Oh, okay. Now I have to not be... Not break line of sight. Good. Come on, a little more, a little more. That's the ticket. But I want to spin it around this way. There we go. Let's do this. So we had a fun little chase sequence. Uh, we had to drop all of our stuff so we could cart Mama back to uh, her twin sister, Lachna, up in the mountains. And I'm sure carrying a body through the mountains won't have any negative impact whatsoever. All right. Let's get this destruction. Oh, I built the... I built the... Oh, I thought I built the wrong thing for a second. I was like, wait a sec. Did I build, like, a, a recharge station? Crap. Uh, let's zip it. Woo! That is a waterfall. That's fun. All right, dismount. Now that's how you zip line. Now, that saved us a lot of time. Unfortunately, we still have to go all the way over there. And like I said, we, we can go through the mountains, but oh man, I really feel like that's probably not a good idea. What we should do though, Let's go back to the safe house and build ourselves another bike, at the very least. And I will say we should probably ditch our armor plating for some anti-BT weapons. Because if we have to go through the mountain uh, pass again, we're going to need some anti-BT weapons. Because I don't know... Oh, my footwear's almost ruined. Oh, did we drop our footwear, Sam? Tell me we didn't. Okay, we didn't. Let's use... Let's see, chiral boots. Let's use the chiral boots. I don't know to what degree the chiral boots are better than level 3 bridges boots, but... We're going to say they are. Yeah, climb that cl the rocky cliff face, Sam. Yes, climb it like a boss. I said like a boss. It's not very boss-like. All right. I think how Mama's got the battery back strapped to her. <laughs> Yes, up them hill. Pump them legs, Sam. Yeah, it's very good. Also, uh, because this is the second episode of Death Stranding this week, you all should be enjoying your second bonus Halloween week episode. Again, hopefully uh, everybody enjoys those. For the few of you who tune in to watch, uh, I enjoy making them. Uh, suffice to say, it has been a really rough week for me, but uh, it's kind of all worth it to get these videos out into the world. I'm still kind of secretly don't tell anyone, but I'm still struggling as to what to make the uh, the mega Halloween episode this year. You there, Sam? The hospital I was staying at was crushed by a bridge. The love nightmares got it. Still hear the crack before it all came tumbling down. I've been scared to death of bridges ever since. Um, yeah. I know how that must sound, considering I'm an employer. <sighs> I'm scared of the dark, too. Don't sleep anymore. Can't. Well, was, was that it for story time? I didn't want to interrupt you. Okay. All right. Uh, you know what? Maybe it doesn't make any sense to get um, 
to get the bike. We're gonna be going right up the mountain because we can like zip line halfway there. I don't know. It's a it's a rough call. Rough call. Because it was fairly steep the way we went last time. I'm not sure we should go the way we went. I mean, it's pretty straightforward. It's about as straight as we can get. So, eh, you know what? Yeah, let's let's just go that way. Oh, wait, no. Let's actually plot the, the path to where we know the way to go. There we go. Alright. Build me a bike real quick. No, don't punch terminal. Love terminal. There we go. Recycle my old stanky boots, please. And should probably recycle these armor plates so we can get some guns. Yeah, I, I've seen this a million times. Thank you. Thank you for your continued support. Oh, you're welcome. So now, oh, I don't have enough of any of this stuff to fabricate weapons. That's unfortunate. We can make a hematic, hematic grenade. Uh, I really don't want to make those, but hey, what are, you, what are you gonna do? Oh, we don't have enough for bikes either. We're SOL. Well, I suppose we'll just uh, make two of those. Better than nothing. Yeah, that'll have to do, I guess. Thank no no bike for us, it seems like, so we can just head on over to the zip line, which we'll take to the other zip line, which will then walk horizontally up a cliff face. What could go wrong? And I'm pretty sure this is what I did, um... Last time, when I played this game originally, I kind of just went back up the mountain. I don't know if, um, that's actually what the game wants you to do, though. I just... The game gives you freedom of movement to traverse all these distances, so I just assumed that's what I wanted. Yeah, zip line, saving us some time. Now, if only there was one up on the top of this hill, we'd be in good shape. Yeah, looks like end of the road. Well, that's the end of the chiral network anyway. I think BB enjoyed the ride. Got some more low roar today, nice. Nice slow trek up the snowy mountain face. Let's actually get a nice cinematic look at the way we're going here. I love that you leave trails in the snow as you walk. It's great stuff. Thanks for the friendly words of uh, encouragement. Really appreciate it, Mama.
the longest steep part. All right, let's boogie. Come on, Sam. Let's. This is max speed. We are flat out hilarious. I wonder why they even let you use the sprint mode when it affords you nothing. It seems kind of a silly thing to do. Like, sprinting while climbing directly up a mountain is pointless. Just walk. Oh, hold on there, Sam. It's a little slippery. You're trudging through like six inches of fresh powder. Weird. It sounded like somebody was running up the snow behind me there for a second. Oh, that was freaky. Didn't like that at all. Ooh, this is gonna be rough. This is pretty, pretty vertical here. Hey, come on, Sam, get up there. Yeah. Eh, eh, that's a spice. Oh, it's the hot springs. We made it. Sweet. Sam, you take a dip in the hot springs? Mama? Hot springs? No? I guess not. Another time, perhaps. You know what we do need, though? We need to take a sip from our uh, canteen. Because we are low. Sweet, sweet stamina. Excellent. Too bad this roboticist isn't home. We could have him fabricate some stuff, but no, we're just doing this, apparently. Now, obviously, straight up the cliff face is not the best route to go there. Um, looks like around the side. And it's weird, the map the map shows our exact path that we took last time to get here, right? But under no circumstances can I see it out in the world. Like, there's the path that I've set with the markers, but I can't just see the path I walked last time. Now, obviously, the snow, like, I can't see with my eyes out in the world. Uh-oh. the heck was that? Yeah, I was gonna say, please don't. Okay, I was gonna say, please don't. I really don't have the armaments for this, but, you know, you you do you, BTs. Oh, yeah, that's... I'm really gonna do that. That sounds like a thing that anyone should do ever. I was gonna say, apart from doing it once, uh... Like, to, to Mama's uh, ghost baby. I don't think I've ever done this ever again. So. Sneaking up on the BTs. How do you... How do you sneak up on something you can't see its face? Let's, let's give this a try. This should go well. Okay, that that did work. I don't I don't see that working ever again though, so we're just we're gonna try and avoid them or at the very least throw grenades at them from here on out. Uh, we should really go through there. Oh this this path through these mountains is just so arduous. <laughs> Ah, oh, yes, up the vertical cliff face. The sanest way to go. Directly to where the, the scanner is saying there's BTs. Of course, why, why would you go any other way?
It's one of those moments where it's like, the, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and not do that. As much as I know that's what you want me to do. Don't give me freedom of choice and then expect me to do things that are crazy. Because uh, I will not. Oh, that's a steep boy. That's also a steep boy. Oh, man. Well, whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, nice and easy here, Sam. It's pretty, pretty dangerous. Oh, Sam, Sam. Steady, steady. No, no, Sam, Sam, what are you doing? Why are you going that way? What are you... There we go. He, he was just walking to the left there, even though I was holding up. I think he was just, uh... No, no, Sam, easy, easy. Nice. Reached marker two. Oh, okay. there we go. Into the snowy wasteland. Yeah, it was all right. No problem. Sam. Hey, Sam. Do you remember your own birth? Me. I remember being inside the womb. I wasn't alone. I could hear my mother's heartbeat. Hers. And Lachna's. We were conjoined twins. One and the same before we were born. But then they tried to separate us. The surgery. The operation was successful. But we were still one. We knew each other's thoughts without saying a word. My joy was her joy. Her pain it was my pain. And no distance was too great for us to overcome. Some might call it a kind of telepathy. Divided in body. Joined in spirit. Yet each just for us. When we shared our own private chiral network. I might say. With cupids, we can build one that will let everyone share what Lachna and I have. I saw it all laid out before me after I signed up for Bridges. A network that could unite everyone, no matter how scattered or different. It will make us whole. It wouldn't be about bringing people into line. <clears throat> It would be about bringing them into the fold. Where they would share and share alike. I knew it could change the world. With Amelie's help, we finalized the Cupid design. But after the attack and the birth, everything changed. For the first time in my life. Lachna wasn't there. But I'm not alone anymore. I can feel her again. She's close. Yeah. Thank you, Sam. I feel whole again. You and me, sis. Me and me. Well, that's a touching story, Mama, as usual. Still have no real frame of reference on beaches and the Death Stranding and just on how any of this works on any level, but it's all very fun. I do appreciate it. And now they start playing, looks like we made it. Because it does, it looks like we made it. Oh, I don't think we should go that way. That looks like a sheer drop. Oh, was that sandalwood? Oh, nope, that was chiral crystals. Sam, get the chiral crystals. 
need all the Cairo crystals. Oh, that's not very... That's not very gentle either. Sam, Sam, Sam. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's not kill Mama a hundred feet from her destination, please. That'll look poorly on my record, which is already pretty poor. I know this isn't the way the, the marker said to go, but I, it seemed like a obvious way to go that was much smoother than everything else. <laughs> There we go. Wow, it's it's regular just dirt, not snow. How about that? Let's boogie. Get the T-1000 run going on here. Home sweet home, mama. Well, that was less uh, crazy than I thought it was going to be. I figured that was going to be a huge pain in the tuchus. It was only a moderate tuchus pain. Yes, I have your human being strapped to my back. You can get her whenever. I couldn't. You don't have to say any more. Hotman. You need to fix his cupid. I couldn't save our child, but you can save our world. Only you. I love you. You hear me? Forever. And always. Now, make the world whole. Okay? Just like you make me. Kind of a downer there. Give me that S rank though. There we go. Sorry, I was just, I was kind of like really bummed out by that transition. Just thinking to myself, humans are strange people. We, we carry these burdens no one ever asked us to carry. And then we, uh, we basically die to refuse to fix them. Thanks for all the stuff. Uh, yes. All that she went through, I had no idea. I thought, I thought she'd severed our bond on purpose, that she stole our child and ran. I 
I fixed your cupid like she asked. Limiters should be functioning properly now. There is one thing. Before I sat down to work, I took a long, hard look at the code. I'm pretty sure someone's tweaked it. Either that, or my memory's going to pieces. Someone rewrote your code? Rewrote might be overstating it. Let's just say it wasn't the latest version I released. And yet, because of it, I was finally reunited with Malingan. Could be we found our culprit already. She died beneath the rubble, with our child still inside her. Her ka passed over to the other side, but her ha remained bound to our dead daughter. She knew all of this, of course. That's why she kept one cuff loose. Didn't want anyone seeing her vitals. Shame she couldn't use her favorite invention. She did all that to keep me and our daughter safe. New strand established. Mountain Nut City has joined the UCA. New interviews, good. Uh, Bridges HQ has added the following backpack customization feature. Stabilizers, ooh. Local data from Mountain Nut City has enabled Bridges HQ to add some for a new structure to your PCC level two cargo catapult. <laughs> Shoot cargo great distances for no reason. Lovely. The chiral network has been connected. Sis? I can hear you. We're whole again. We're one. Like before in the womb, remember? Lincoln. Akna. Not City is finally within reach. And you, Lachna, your work will help ensure that the Chiron Network remains online. Together, we might just make it all the way west. Now then, Sam, there's something else you ought to know. We've been studying the data from when you claim you encountered those soldiers. We had audio, which doesn't paint a complete picture on its own, but the languages, the names, and terms we picked out, the munitions we could identify. Everything seems to indicate that you were on a battlefield over a hundred years ago. World War I, to be precise. It wasn't a dream. It wasn't a hallucination. Maybe you were spirited away to another dimension or something. And given the time discrepancies, maybe you were sent to a beach. Can't say anything for certain. That said, I, I've never heard of a beach turned into a battlefield. But beaches are shaped by the will of the people who inhabit them. Perhaps Hartman can offer a more rational explanation. Beaches are his specialty. Unfortunately, he's still outside the chiral network. Anyway, get some rest. No use dwelling on questions we can't answer yet. Your work is greatly... 
Oh, we're sh we're just going right to bed. No, no choice for me. Okay. Is this is this a regular wake up or is something happening? Good morning, Sam. Blood collection complete. Thank you for your generosity. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna guess we're all good here. We're gonna say that's all the time I have for this episode today. Thank you everybody so much for joining me on another exciting look into the world of Death Stranding. Director Scott, I am Devo Lost Time Gaming. If you enjoyed the video today, feel free to leave a like, leave a comment, and get subscribed. Let me know down in the comment section below what you thought about my gameplay and my commentary. Or anything else in general. That being said, thanks for watching, and as usual, I'll catch you all on the flip side.